Hi everybody, welcome to our new channel. Uh, first of all, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for watching our video. Uh, my name is Ken. And I'm Katie. And today we're just introducing you to our world. Uh, we have some lovely food here that we got from a Longhorn here in Oklahoma. So we have some steaks. We have mashed potatoes. We have our Southern, what do you call this? Uh, <laughs> something chicken wrap. Something they chicken wrap. <laughs> And then we have the uh, onion tonion. Yep. We have macaroni and cheese and salad. And we have a nice loaf, two loaves of bread here. All right. All right. So we're going to eat a little bit and then we'll start to talk about ourselves and stuff. But I don't know about you, but I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm, <super laughs> I'm starving. <hungry. laughs> I am <laughs> so hungry. Yeah. Hope you guys had a good Thanksgiving. I know I did. Cooked a little and had my brother over and stuff and. It was nice. Yeah. Oh, and we also have some A1 sauce here, too. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> you want to let them know about the A1 sauce? Yeah. Okay. All right. Um, this is so weird. I've never <laughs> eaten on camera before. I, this is going to be something I have to get used to. Like, uh, yeah. Know, if we do these. Yeah. Well, our channel will be more than just mukbang so if you're interested in, in just following like, like vlogging and stuff like that we'll have mukbangs every now and again um not all the time but um we'll have mukbangs and then we'll have some other things that we talk about as well yes yeah this uh whole idea of a youtube channel kenyatta's idea <laughs> she's been uh trying to get me to do a youtube channel with her for a while now yeah and uh I don't know. It's kind of crazy to me. Cause, like, I am, like, super low-key to myself. Like, mm -hmm. I stay out of people's business. I like people out of mine. <laughs> so, um, you know, the idea of, like, sharing things about ourselves to, like, the internet is super weird. Yeah. Um, This is definitely something Kenyatta is more suited for. Cause she's super, like, outgoing and... <laughs> Uh, likes to talk a lot. <laughs> so, no, I don't know. I'm like sweaty <laughs> over here. Like, what? Who are we gonna talk about? But well, it's weird eating. Well, we're actually like okay, we're eating by ourselves. But the yeah. idea that someone might watch this is. <laughs> weird. But yeah, thank you for taking the time to watch us. And as we get a little bit, you know, further along, obviously we'll learn all the things that we're supposed to supposed to do and all that kind of stuff so no we'll be doing whatever we want to do <laughs> well, you heard her <laughs> oh, I'm gonna tell you right now like I don't know what mukbangs are supposed to be like or whatever you're supposed to do on YouTube but we're gonna do whatever we do mm -hmm. I don't know yeah I think that's important too to maintain um, your sense of self you know, we were getting all together and everything like that. He was like, no, we can do it different because I wanted to put all the food like on the plates or not on the plates, but on the wood because we have like a little wood um, charcuterie tray, pizza tray thing we have here. But she was like, no, we're going to do it different. Mm -hmm. And I can't say that I don't like it. I love it. I, I like the idea of having mm -hmm. my food separated and stuff. Like I told that. you it would be better on plates. <laughs> I told you. I'm always right. <laughs> Does that mean she's always wrong? That is true. <laughs> You'll learn that as we go along. Mm -hmm. That she is always right. Totally. Well. <laughs> but I can't say that I, I don't like it though. <laughs> I, yeah. How's your steak? Mm. Real quick, really good. Good. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have some of these onion petals here. Eat some of that. And this is ranch. I know I'm supposed to give you guys a bite, but you have to wait until I eat this. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> So we're actually having this meal because um, at my job we get this like dinner benefit, a birthday benefit I guess, um, where instead of like giving us the day off or something, mm -hmm. we get a um, $200 limit on like a meal that you can share with, you know, family or friends or whatever. Mm -hmm. And my birthday was in August, but um, you know, everything being weird with COVID, we were kind of like holding off and waiting and... I was actually thinking like, oh, we'd use it when my parents came to visit or when we went to visit them mm -hmm. and then never got around to it. So 
we were like, okay, it's the end of the year. Let's just go ahead and do it. Let's get like ourselves something to eat. We got a steak for the dogs even. And like, we got some dessert to go with this, which is actually in the kitchen, I think yeah, still. So. Um, so we just thought we'd go ahead and use it. And, and then we were like, hey, if we're going to do a YouTube channel, why not just yeah do it now, I guess? So that's how we got here and how this meal got here. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I mean, I personally have never had a job do that for me. I mean, I feel a little bit, you know, jealous. <laughs> <laughs> but <clears throat> what I used to get for my birthday at my jobs was a birthday card with everybody's signatures. <clears throat> no, you got like a day off one time, didn't you? When I, like, yes, a job? when yeah. I had a, with that one job. Uh -huh. <clears throat> I did have the day off with pay. That was one job and... I'm 34, so <laughs> you can imagine how many jobs I've had. Yeah. So, yeah. I've never had a job give me a day off for my birthday, so. I'll take the $200 out. No, <laughs> no, I wish they would have just been like, here's $200 on a gift card. Like, go mm -hmm. spend it how you want. Um, but the meal's not bad either. Yeah. It would have been cool if we could have done it with, like, my parents or, you know, something like that. But, yeah, uh, things weren't shut down when they came, but... We just never got around to it. Mm -hmm. I think we forgot. And then I went home to Michigan um, to visit them and everything was shut down. So we weren't able to go out to eat to use it. So, yeah. Well, here we are. Lucky yeah. for you. <laughs> I don't even know if you guys can see the food, but it's a lot. It's We, we have a, a lot of food here. <clears throat> yeah, it is. Um, but right. funny story about Longhorn. We were... Um, driving around <clears throat> where we live and um looking for something to eat and i was just like oh let's just try this place and so we went in and i think you did you get the, we both got saved the first time or just you i actually don't know anyway so <clears throat> we went in or whatever and long story short we found like the best steaks in the world uh you know how you can go to a place like um what is it? A Texas Roadhouse or a um, Chili's don't have steaks. What's another Texas? Anyway, know. any other steakhouses that I've ever been in, the steaks are always like little and they cost like 20 something bucks. Well, <clears throat> we got this big steak with size for like $26. And this is a huge steak. I don't know if you can see it, but it's it's huge. And it's good. Not just that because it's big, but it's actually good, which is crazy. Mm -hmm. It's like the best. It, I won't get steaks from anywhere else. Like this is the best steak. If you want to get a steak, you can get this. Now, if I'm cooking a steak, I'll go to like, um, uh, what's this store called? Sprouts. Sprouts to go get the steaks because they have really good steaks too. But if I want to go out to eat, I would recommend to go to the Longhorn Steakhouse. And then here you go. I know you guys want to eat some of it. Hope you can see it. <laughs> but, yeah. Longhorn is the best steakhouse I think I've ever had. I know that I've ever had, so. But, all right. <clears throat> Not that we've tried a lot of steakhouses. This is the best one that I've had. In, in this is like the best chain steak, I guess. Yeah. But yeah. they don't have a lot of places like Longhorn, do you? Where? Who? Longhorn. They don't have a lot of places. Right? You mean restaurants? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I think they do. Oh. They have one in Michigan? Mm-hmm. They have a long one? In like the Detroit area? Oh. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm just glad they have it here. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> but. And probably. About finished in a minute. <laughs> Are you really? I did a lot. That's my steak. Oh, yeah. Your steak was warmed up better. I don't mine. feel like you did eat a lot. I ate a lot of steak, but <clears throat> anyhow, <clears throat> I'm probably, or I know that you guys are probably wondering a little bit about us. Well, <clears throat> I'm an author. I write, um, uh, or I illustrate children's books, and then I also write novels and spoken word poetry. Katie is the one who writes the children's books, like 80% of the writing she does. So that's a little bit about me. I'm also a drummer. Um, I've lived overseas, military brat. Uh, what else about me should they know? I'm grumpy in the mornings. 
<laughs> um, which you can see, you can say, but um, mm -hmm. she kind of has more mood swings than a little bit. <laughs> That's true, yeah, yeah. But so, uh, let's see what else about me that I would want people to know. Mm, I am a people person, I do like to talk a lot. You'll see that as we go along when I get a little bit more comfortable, obviously, because you know, talking and front of people is a little weird <laughs> but uh or people that it's gonna be pre-recorded obviously so you see it much later but yeah i'm a people person um i like katie i like my house <laughs> i like to, i'm learning how to like to be like just to myself you know stuff like that so yeah that's a little bit about me um i'll be posting different things about my life um the further we go along um my books, stuff like that. We'll have conversations about that. I'll uh, vlog, like writing my process and stuff like that, which isn't a process because I just write when I feel like it. <laughs> so yeah, we'll have like a day in the life and all that kind of stuff. So what about you? I'm choking. <laughs> you okay? Um, I don't know what to say about myself. Um, I don't know. That's a, another thing I don't like doing. I don't like, uh, being stuck on camera and I don't like talking about myself. And here we are. Um, I don't know. What do I do for my job? Um, I do marketing. So I manage the marketing and customer care departments, um, at a startup in Chicago. Um, for fun, I don't know. Um, I like to do random projects and go on adventures. I like, you know, I'm kind of like a busybody. Like anytime we should be sitting down and resting, I feel the need to like be working on something or making something or cleaning something. So that's kind of what I'm always doing, looking for something to do or an adventure to go on. Um, our weekends, I feel like I should just utilize every moment of it. So I'm always like, what are we going to do? What are we going to do next? Um, so I'm a super duper planner. I um, probably drive Kenyatta crazy with yeah. that. And, <clears throat> you um, as opposed to Miss Grouchy over here, I'm usually <laughs> the one who's in a really good mood. That's true. Um, that is absolutely true. I am not a people person. <laughs> I So we're like very opposite like Kenyatta mm -hmm. is like a people person like mm -hmm. she loves talking to people and making friends with people everywhere like she literally leaves the house just to go to the gas station like up the street to talk to those people there like she spends an ungodly amount of money just buying things so truly honestly just to go talk to those people like, <laughs> so we could have everything we need in the house but she'll still go there to get something to drink like just so she can talk to those people it's true um, I'm not like that at all. <laughs> so I like say to myself, I'm, uh, like pretty much truly an introvert. Like I, you know, I like my dogs and I like my family and sometimes I like Kenyatta and <laughs> <What>? <laughs> I know where it ends. Um, I don't really know what else to say about myself. Um, I don't know. How would you describe me, Kenyatta? Um, I would describe you as a pleasant introvert. I think that honestly, you can I have some of that uh, egg one sauce first of all. This I need some sauce. Some uh, sauce. Some, uh, sauce. Mm -hmm. But um, I think that you're a introverted person who is also loving and kind and caring to those people who either need or deserve it. <clears throat> I think you're sweet. I think you're attentive to detail. Obviously, I think that. You take your time to do something you that you do it the right way and you try to do it the right way the first time she tries to do stuff the right way the first time so that way she doesn't have to go back and do it or mistakes and stuff are made which is a good she all the qualities that she has is good which is why i've been with her for years <laughs> and i do mean years like we're gonna be pushing a decade soon so yeah so from the time i met you she's just been like a loving lovely person who cares about people but she just don't like none of y'all she don't want to be friends. <laughs> None of that. So if you're an introverted person, 
and you understand and you love this channel because you know we do we're, we will be doing a lot of stuff which most channels are the same way that i've seen most people who do stuff they do it by themselves or they're with their significant other and stuff like that um this probably won't be a channel where we're going to be pranking each other and stuff like no. that <laughs> no <laughs> I'll, I'll let her take over <laughs> okay so we can list all the things this channel won't be <laughs> um it won't be pranks because no mm -hmm. i don't play that um, this so won't be mean. a light. I am not mean. <laughs> I'm just I was like, she's sweet. She's mean. <laughs> All right. I, can, I can be mean. But it won't be a prank channel because that's just stupid. Mm -hmm. Like, honestly, there's no way that you're like living in a house with a person and you guys are like setting up things every day and you don't know that the person that you're with is pranking you <laughs> every single day yes. and there won't be like breakup pranks because that's stupid mm -hmm. or cheating pranks like mm -mm. for one that's childish and we're too old for that like mm -hmm. we're in our 30s but we're not gonna do that yeah no nope we won't be doing pranks no we won't be pranking each other so if that's Something that you like and stuff like that, and that's you. That's your. That's your right to like it. Believe you me. I, I'm just not entertained by that. So, we want to invite people to our page. Obviously, who have the same interests as, as us. We are both adults. Um, like I said, I don't know. I'm never gonna say never. I'm not gonna. As far as like relationship pranks, absolutely not. But like, I don't. I don't even know what kind of prank I would do to you. There's not very many. No. <laughs> but we want our channel to be. Wholesome. We want our channel to, you know, we want to eat foods and stuff. We'll eat some cool food sometimes. Um, I'm going to let you know right now that this one is a super taster. So she doesn't like a lot of stuff. And we were actually like joking about that earlier today. Like she's just going to be like a compilation of things Katie won't eat. <laughs> well, so I, I'm not like that. I like to try and taste everything. Now, there's some stuff I won't. Absolutely not. But I just want our channel to be filled with a lot of different things. Not just mukbangs. Katie's also a super decorator. Um, I'll put in right now the clip of our um, Chris, some of our Christmas decorations that we have. So I'll insert that here. And uh, so now that you're back, you can see that Katie does a lot of different decorations and stuff. And she's really good about uh, decorating our house decorations, no matter where we have lived. Um, she's 100%. I just step out of the way, you know, like she's going to fall down and break her ankle or something like that. But <laughs> I can't take any credit for any of the decor in the house. Like she goes and picks out stuff and stuff. And so we'll have stuff like that where we'll take you with us to the store or, you know, we'll show you how she puts stuff together. She made a really cute um, Christmas tree. And so what well, we are, she already made one. So we'll show you the one she made and then we'll try to make it together <laughs> we have our vlogmas that's coming so I, I can't say that mine's gonna be anywhere near as good as hers but just bear with me you know but hers oh, her stuff is really really dope and i'm gonna blow you out of the water yeah <laughs> yeah you are you, gonna, you are gonna blow me out of the water but that's that's okay we'll have a drawing contest and then oh yeah, yeah, I'm, yeah, done. yeah. <laughs> I'm out nope <laughs> but yeah so that's the kind of like it'll what, just be this channel if we keep this up because who knows but if we do it'll just be the regular things we do in our regular life already mm -hmm. we just might record some of it mm -hmm. and i mean honestly like i don't know how well we'll do with that but um it won't be anything crazy it'll just be regular stuff i like to make things i like crafts i like to i don't know bake things i like mm -hmm. regular stuff like we like adventures like it's kind of winterish right now so there's not a ton of outdoor things that we're doing right now. I do not like the cold weather. And I mean, we're fortunate enough that right now it's like, I think it was 70 degrees out today. Like it was it like 69. Was nice, sunny. Um, it was nice. So, you know, we have some nice weather right now because we are kind of in the uh, south. Yeah. But um, in the summer, like, we'll do regular adventures and we might share those. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, we'll do some things together. And I don't know if that's it. And... We're not going to be the most interesting people in the world because we're not doing fake pranks and all of that. I mean, you might be interesting. I'm kind of like regular. No. Um, you're not but, regular. you know, if you want to watch that, then you can but you join us. But, but that's what I'm saying. Like, but we're not going to do anything crazy to like 
try to be a, a YouTube whatever. Like, yeah. um, we'll be living our regular lives and you guys can join yeah. and be a part of that if you want, I guess. Um, yeah. We'll be here. So we'll do a couple things here. We'll do, like I said, regular adventures, our crafts. Kenyatta will do some like cook with me things. Yeah. We'll do some like experiments with recipes. Um, I don't cook <laughs> at all. So we'll do some of that, like trying that out. I do like to bake though. So we'll do some just like fun things. I'm not like yeah. an expert, but we'll do like fun things that she and I already do. Like we mm -hmm. do like cake decorating challenges for holidays. So we'll do yeah. some of that. Um, you know, you'll go with us on some adventures and try new foods. Like she said, I have the palate of a child. <laughs> so more than anything else, you'll just see a lot of foods that I don't like and what I won't eat. Yeah. So um that'll be us that'll be this channel if you want to join along then you know you're yeah. welcome to do that so with oh, that being said go ahead one more thing that i want to say we have the same initials so it's going to be team kg so just so you know ahead of time and i think i said something about kg squared or something you know something lame but we'll, we'll get it together we'll figure something out for our like you know just our team handle or whatever but yeah, I'm excited. I, I think we did good and, you know, we ate enough. <laughs> I'll tell you that. But, um, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. And I hope that you guys continue to stay safe, uh, wear your masks, and also to just remember to love yourself, you know, before anybody else. So that way you can give love to others. And that's, that's how we're going to end it. Yep. <laughs> All, right. All right. Thanks Bye for guys. tuning in. Bye.